This is the Casio Tone CT6500, the big boy, the king of the Casio Tones. Look at it. It's got full MIDI. It's got multiple outputs. It's got a strange cover cap thing. Um, but that's enclosing a 61-note keyboard that is uh, got onboard speakers, which is never really a good thing. But look at all those buttons. It's got every effect, um, you know, uh, different volume controls for every part of the, the mix that it creates, um, loads of rhythms and sounds that you can apply to your rhythms. And look at that, a pitch bend and modulation that's never uh, seen on the Casio. Now, I literally just got this thing today. This is the first time I'm actually playing it, aside from playing it on top of the stovetop at the house where I bought it. Uh, it is a big thing, um, and I'm going to try to figure it out, but I won't get everything right, I'm sure. sounds that are used in the CZ series, the, the professional end of Casio, uh, but it's on the, the home version. So it's a, it's a bit of a mix, but they didn't do any wave shaping or anything with this. So it's like literally everything you can do is at the push of a button, um, but still there's a lot of options. out through MIDI so you have five channels of um, rhythm and your of course melody um, so it, this, this is going to be really fun to use as a controller for better sounding sense.
there's like so much you can do just playing with the rhythm part that you don't even need to use the keys to have some fun with it. First impressions, sounds aren't that great. They're kind of like the presets of the CZ, a little bit boring. I can't really do a lot to, to change them up too much. But boy, it, this is a fun keyboard and probably the best thing I've ever seen with Casio tone written on it. Um, I'm gonna give it some more love and attention and come up with my, you know, my real opinion of it. But first thoughts, you know, for the 50 euros I put into it, it's uh, definitely worth it. And uh, you know. Thank you.